Yep guys, welcome to my channel, it's Room Xblade and in today's video, I'll show you how you can remove watermark from Prisma 3D 3.0's videos without buying the subscription from this app. So here I have this Minecraft scene and if I want, I can remove the watermark because I bought the subscription of this app but if you don't have the subscription, you can still remove the watermark. So to do that, just simply render your scene first and as you can see I am rendering the scene with watermark so you can as you do can't remove it but I'll show you a secret trick to do that and here let's just render this scene and well you don't need any mod apk or something like that you can simply do this with the original app so here the render is done and as you can see the watermark is still here so let's save this scene to gallery and after that we have to copy the camera of your scene so here we have to copy the camera so let's copy it and after copying it from the copied camera delete the animation click on the animation and delete and after that we have to drag the camera to the animated camera so let's parent the non animated camera with the animated camera so the copied camera will go inside the animated camera so let's drag it okay and after that your camera's position must be 0 0 and 0 so set all the position of your non animated camera to 0 I mean copied anime copied camera to 0 and the rotations also will be 0 0 and 0 so set the copied camera's rotations to 0 0 and 0 and after that the z axis rotation will be minus 180 or 180 so set the last rotation to minus 180 or normal 180 and after that go inside the copied camera and again render the scene so here also i have the i didn't remove the watermark because you can't do that so let's just render the scene And after the render is done, just save your scene to gallery. So click on save to gallery. And then open KineMaster app. You can use any video editing app which you use. I am here comfortable with KineMaster so I will use this. So after that add your the first render. As you can see here. Still we have the like the watermark. And then add the second render that we rendered as a layer and after adding the second render we have to rotate it to like first set it to full screen and then rotate this clip to 180 degree okay so the rotation is done and after that you have to go to crop and crop the watermark portion or the watermark part and then if I play as you can see the watermark is removed so the this trick is simple you just have to like both part of the video which is don't have watermark and just from one video you have to and from one video you just have to trim the watermark part so if you understand the video so yeah this is the trick and if you like the video you know what to do and we will meet again in next video bye